this video tutorial I will explain using a Spring JDBC template how to query multiple rows from the database table. Using Spring JDBC template, we can get uh, multiple rows from the database table and uh, convert it into a list. Here you can see the employee table. It has uh, three rows. We will see how to get uh, all these rows and uh, convert to list of uh, employee objects. Here you can see the pom.xml. Here we have defined string dependencies and MySQL dependencies. Here I have defined the class employee. It has four properties employee ID, name, age, and salary. Here I have defined the interface uh, employee DAO. It has uh, one abstract method uh, find all. Here I have defined the class uh, employee DAO impl, which extends uh, JDBC DAO support class and implements uh, employee DAO interface and provide implementation of uh, find all method. This method returns uh, list of uh, employees. This is a spring configuration file. Spring container read this spring configuration file and it creates a data source object. To create data source object, spring container needs to know driver class name, URL of the database, username and password of the database. Once a data source object is created, it is injected to employee DAO impl. Here I have defined the class app here I have created application context object by reading a spring configuration file using getbean method of application context object getting employee DO object from spring container then calling find all method of employee DO object this method returns a list of employees that I am printing here and printing the size of the list. Here I have defined the SQL select star from employee table. Then I am calling query for list method of JDBC template object and passing the SQL. This method returns list of map objects. The list contains uh, three map objects. Each map object represents one row from the employee table. This is the first row information. This is the second row information. And uh, this is the third row information. Using uh, for each loop, I am getting uh, each map from the list and uh, formulating the employee object and uh, adding to the employee list. And uh, here you can see the employee list contains three employee objects. And if you see in the employee table, there are three rows are there. And we got sizes 3.
you can get uh, Java source code link from the description of the video. In mobile, to see the description, click on uh, this icon. It will expand like this and uh, here you can see the description. It contains uh, Java source code links. Click on these links to get the Java source code. 